This is the DCM Sri Ram of today, an organization which is on the threshold of a big leap. A leap which will be led by leaders who are empowered. A leap which will automate all processes. A leap which will change everything for the better. And behind every leap, there is a desire to define benchmarks, to set new standards, to carve the path to a better future. Our journey with SAP started in 1997 with implementation of an ERP software called SAP R3. This was primarily in Kota and Delhi. Since then, our businesses have grown and new businesses have been added. The number of locations have expanded within India and internationally. With a fast-changing world environment, both in businesses and technologically, we felt a need to upgrade our systems and processes. In June 2014, we set up Project LEAP. We wanted a robust, agile system to meet different business needs. We set up a BPEG with six streams to look at the pain points and identify improvement areas from a futuristic point of view. It's really good that the users across businesses are driving the entire process. Our partnership with SAP has enhanced over the years and with our discussions, we figured that they have launched a new product called S for HANA in February 15. This is a world-class product, graphic user interface based, and it will ease the way of working. This will also address our diverse business needs. We wanted a cloud-based platform and have mobile solutions. We have outsourced our servers to HEC, which is a HANA Enterprise Cloud. Our endeavor is to enable DCM Shiram to have a further positive work culture, focusing on simple solutions, smart performance. We engaged Accenture in February 2015 to redesign our business processes with the intent to deliver some key objectives, like technologically enable and equip our businesses, provide real-time and online information, provide access to capture events on real-time, business partners linkage, like vendors, customers, banks, enabling a seamless integration to our businesses, as an outcome of this exercise, Accenture developed a business blueprint document and a technology roadmap. The next task was to realize the process changes recommended by Accenture and therefore SAP Services was engaged to implement S4 HANA newly launched platform of SAP in October 2015 to deliver this entire project in two different phases. The first phase getting over by April 2016 and the second phase by October 2016. Today we are proud to have achieved the Go Live milestone of Phase 1. Project LEAP comprised of six different core processes, all aiming to provide an enhanced experience to all the stakeholders of the company. Today's marketplace is very dynamic and competitive. Our ability to anticipate change and agility of our response determines our level of success in the market. This is possible only if we digitally empower our field force and integrate them to the rest of the organization. Post Project Leap, we expect our field force to have all the information that they need on their mobile phones at the click of a button. Before he walks into a customer's premises, he can get a 360 degree view of the customer his order status, his outstandings, his past concerns, etc. The discussion with the customer will be much more productive. On the whole, the sales and marketing organizations will get freed up from a lot of unnecessary work and they can focus on more productive work like market strategy, demand generation and creating a brand equity in the marketplace. Well, I would say that our journey in Project Leap for record to report process started almost two, three years back. Whenever the accountants have been meeting for the last two, three years, an uh, underlying need has been felt to upgrade all our accounting processes. The real drivers and the benefits that we expect on implementation on Project Leap and as for HANA is that we will come to real-time reporting. The, all the transactions will become online. There will be faster closure of accounts and balance sheet finalization. The focus while implementing S for HANA and Project Leap 
has also been on improving the financial controls across all processes, across the businesses and across the organization. The entire R2R team is really excited about implementing S for HANA. With the implementation of S4 HANA, some of the main advantages in P2P stream are like gate entry and payment directly on SAP platform, which was earlier through a separate software, warehouse management for better inventory management, tracking of returnable chalans, LETRA for better freight management, workflow based joint measurement sheet for proper accounting and measurement of services, implementation of Colebra, which is OptiSuite for reporting of excise, service tax and other taxes. We are also implementing workflow-based master data governance. The journey does not end here as some more advantages are planned for implementation in second phase. Plan to produce starts from planning of production and its resources to completion of the production. It encompasses three verticals, production planning module, quality module, and plant maintenance module. Some key changes which shall lead to key benefits to the organization under plant maintenance vertical are standardization of catalogs on lines of ISO and assigning them to individual equipments, categorization of equipments based on technical object type, classification of equipments based on their characteristics, grouping of equipments based on their criticality, for various activities and also for reporting purposes. Broadly, PM can be better leveraged to increase equipment or plant availability and thereby improving productivity of people and equipment. Under quality module vertical, we are extending quality monitoring system from earlier only finished goods and key raw materials to now all incoming materials and in-process materials. In production planning module, day-wise process orders can now be created seamlessly from monthly plans. With these improvements, plan to produce processes are now configured to meet business requirements better. As part of LEAP project, HR team started this journey with an objective to harmonize the HR processes across the organization and more importantly to align our systems and processes with best in industry practice for providing enhanced employee experience. We have tried to streamline and automate various HR modules like goal management, ESS, performance management, which will be available to employees 24 hours 7. By making process simpler and faster, we sincerely feel this will reduce duplicity of effort, improve efficiency, and improve effectiveness of the employees, as well as productivity of the organization. Managers will have real-time data which will help in decision making and achieving measurable performance. I hope all these efforts will lead to a user-friendly, simple and personalized employee experiences. Over the last couple of years, it has been our endeavor to move towards a robust system of business performance reporting or MI as we call it. We are now in the process of taking a big leap forward. We embarked this transformation journey in February last year, wherein we started with understanding the needs of the business and translating into improved MI framework. The new MI framework will be highly automated, interactive and analytical in the form of dynamic dashboards, which will be available anytime, anywhere. It will be a paradigm shift. Apart from these six processes, Project Leap takes into its ambit several other teams and processes, each as crucial as the other. The aim was to revolutionize all these processes by bringing them under a single ambit. And to do this, it was necessary to implement SAP S4 HANA, an aim that we successfully achieved. An aim that was made possible through the expertise of the SAP team. Hi hey everybody, my name is Scott Russell. I'm the COO for SAP across Asia, Pacific and Japan. And even more importantly, I'm the executive sponsor for SAP on behalf of DCM Truram. And it is my privilege, my honor and my real joy to congratulate all of the team on your success in Project Leap. What an incredible milestone. 
DCM Sri Ram and SAP have a wonderful history together. Over 20 years we've been working together to help your business run better, but also for you to give us insights about how SAP can perform and help our businesses run even better than before. You've been a true pioneer in your industry and we have benefited in that partnership. But you've also been a pioneer when it comes to technology. You were a part of the innovation from SAP from the very beginning and with S4 and the transformation the Project Loop brings, you're very much at the forefront again to what innovation through technology can do to really transform a business. So I really want to congratulate the entire team for a wonderful outcome. I really wish I could be there. But if I can say, I want to particularly thank my friend, but also someone that I really respect, and that is Ajit Sriram. These projects can only happen through leadership that comes from foresight, comes from inspiration, and providing strategic direction. Ajit, yourself and your entire leadership team have led this program to absolute success, knowing how to get the best out of your own organisation, but also looking to SAP and really working with us as a strategic partner. And for that, I want to say thank you. And in return, you can be very assured that SAP's commitment to your business continues to grow and prosper. We've had an exciting 20 years in the past, and I can't wait for the next 20 years. This is the first of many milestones that we will achieve together going forward in the innovation partnership to really run your business as a digital enterprise. So congratulations, I can't wait to see you soon in person and I hope you have a great party and celebrate. Thank you. Today, we are happy to go live with Leap. Today, DCM Sriram takes this leap. Months of hard work, dedication, innovation, thoughts, problems and solutions all come to fruition. We have put in efforts and the outcome will show. We have led a revolution. We have overcome challenges. We have celebrated victories all for this day. So get ready DCM Sri Ram because the time has come for a future of progress, for a future of innovation, for a future of unprecedented growth. The time has come for us to take a lead.